comprehension is really what reading is all about. You have to be able to figure out what the words say on the page, but if you don't understand what those words mean, you haven't really read it. And I think we've all been there before. How often have you been sitting in front of a television, watching a TV show, watching a TV show, and somebody comes in and says, oh, what's on? And you have no idea what you're actually sitting there watching? That's what happens to kids a lot of times whenever they're reading. They could be reading the words and they might not miss a single word in what they're reading, but their brain is somewhere else entirely. If they don't have the ability to talk about what they've read, it does not really count as reading. And that's what comprehension is. Now, here's the tricky part on comprehension. There are so many parts and pieces that go into it. The rest of the videos in this series are going to deal with comprehension. And I've got them grouped together according to some reasonable chunks and how you can look at it because kids at different levels are expected to be able to talk about stories in different ways. So we're gonna talk about each of those separately because there's an awful lot to it. But what you need to understand about comprehension is that it's not just retelling the story. That's a piece of it, but it goes beyond that. We expect kids to be able to dive into characters and be able to explain why they may have done something the way that they did it, even though it doesn't say it in the story. You might, we might expect kids to say what a character might do. This character, how might they act if this happened? To be able to take that, those character traits and then apply them to a new situation based on what we know about the character. Um, we expect kids to be able to talk about how this story is like this story, even though they may not be similar on the surface, that the themes are the same underneath. There is so much to comprehension. And so we're going to break this apart so you can look at each piece as is appropriate for your child.